children. It's already 10 o'clock in the morning. So, it's time for story time. But before that, I am Teacher Roshane and I have here a Fables book with my Jumbo Book of Ace of Fables. So, when Fables, when we said Fables, the character of a book is animals. So, this book is published by Dreamland Publications, which this edition is printed in 2012. So, this book has a set of eight illustro illustrated stories. I will choose a one story for today. So, are you ready to listen? Okay, that's great. So, our story for today is about is about a thirsty crow. So, a crow is a type of bird. So, listen carefully. Okay? Okay, I will start. The thirsty crow. One hot day, a thirsty crow flew all over the fields looking for water. So, the crow is looking for a correct water. But he couldn't get water anywhere. He soon got tired and decided to rest upon a big mango tree. About to get up hope. So, the thirsty crow wants to give up his hope. So, he landed on a big mango tree. Then suddenly... The crow saw a vase which was sitting on the other side of the tree. With wishful eyes, he flew straight down to see if there was any water inside. Then he peeped into the tall vase and did find some water in it. So, what does the crow see on the vase, inside the vase? Okay, a little water. Then, the, said, the thirsty crow said, Aha! Finally, I got water. He tried to push his head into the vase to put. He could not reach the water because the water was dipped below the mouth of the vase. So, the water level is a small amount of water inside the vase. So what do you think? Will the crow what will the crow do to get the water inside the vase? Okay, let's see. Then the crow thought hard for a while. Then looking around, he picked some pebbles on the ground and dropped them into the vase one after and the other. Then as more and more pebbles filled the pot, the water level kept rising. So, it was high enough for the crow to drink. The crow's eyes sparkled and without wasting any time, he drank the water to his heart's content. So, finally, the thirsty crow is his thirstiness. So, the moral lesson of the story is if you try hard, you will find an answer to your problem. So, the moral lesson of the story that I have read is if you try hard, you will find an answer to your problem. So based on the story, as a student, what do you think is the reason or purpose that you are here in the school? Okay, yes, you want to have a diploma. Okay, you want your parents proud and also to be a successful someday. But before that, if you want to achieve your goals or aims in your life, what do you think is the key to achieve those goals? Okay, you need to study and you need to work hard to achieve those things on your list bucket. So, work hard and to be a successful someday. So that's for today. I hope you enjoy and you like it, the story. Thank you.